So I want to ask a serious question, does crowdfunding work? And what I mean by that, well, what I mean by work, I mean, do you able to raise the funds that you set out to do so? Now, the evidence so far that I've been able to pull is that less than 95%, and it could be higher, actually fail. Fail. The other problem is uh, basically uh, those that do succeed are those that get predominant featured coverage. So there's no system for, you know, for them to choose who gets featured. They say, oh, it's part of our engine or whatever that decides, but someone's making the choices. You know, because I've been unable to get um, Kickstarter campaigns, and all they do is they send me an announcement saying, I'm sorry, but you've been refused, and they will tell you why. And um, uh, basically what I've had to do is actually go to uh, Indiegogo. And here's Indiegogo, actually Indiegogo here, right? Here's the countdown, final countdown on my listed. I got seven hours left on my campaign, right? Seven hours left. Um, and um, seven hours, and I'm not listed. So why am I not listed in the final countdown, um, right? Um, and this is a big reason why I believe I probably, this campaign is going to fail. Um, if I go to the environment section, here's the environment section, seven hours, no beekeeping Japan, not listed. Even though you can, you know, even though you can see my statistics here, right, I'm listed here as environment. Um, environment. Is it because I have a fixed goal? Probably because so, I don't know. But if it's a fixed goal, they don't make any money if I don't succeed. So that doesn't make sense. <laughs> Why wouldn't they want to feature me? Um, here's our referrals. So yes, I've been working. Um, Michael J. Trout referrals, over 3,000 referrals. Look at that. Wow, wouldn't you like to have me working for your campaign? Um, and uh, here, I've I only got three people who have helping to refer it, um, even though I've referred it um, so many places. Is it because they don't like the idea? But the, the point of um, keeping it so low was we don't need a lot of money for beekeeping, right? To buy the hive, to buy the bees and everything else. $500 is all you really need to get going. And really, I did the campaign to show people that, yes, we are able to raise the funds to get going and to uh, bring something about. What's really sad is that Kickstarter promotes, I mean, Kickstarter, Indiegogo promotes itself as a, you know, as a helping entrepreneurs, and I'm an entrepreneur. I've been doing startups for 16 years, and here I am as an entrepreneur not getting the kind of support that I need. Um, so I, f I feel like they're failing President Obama, they're failing entrepreneurs and startups, and, and uh, you know, and it's just sad. And I just wish that uh, someone would provide some answers and tell us why, you know, why wasn't Beekeeping Japan listed, right? Is this, you know, story, is the goals, is the project really that bad? Um, why aren't you fulfilling President Obama's and your, um, you know, what you set out to do? And, um, you know, what can we do to fix it? I'll run the campaign again see if we can do better um, but I should be able to raise $500 in a month everyone should be able to raise $500 in a month to get beekeeping startup um, over 50% of the bees since in the last 10 years have, 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 have declined 50% imagine 50% of the world population went from 7 billion to 3.5 billion in 10 years imagine the outcry right 30% of bees are dying every year all right, every year they're declining by 30%. This initiative is vital, and yet you, I'm not getting the support that we need. It's really sad.